So that level down there is actually the gymnasium level, and then it comes out into. This could be our future wrestling room right here. So I'll parents. Yeah, parents. Okay. Right. Yeah, and just a big fifty, just a big fifty by fifty, man. We got some. Who's gonna go one? One more time. One one fifty by fifty, Matt. Um, well, we got an old can of McMillan mat. Okay. Uh, forty-two by forty-two, and then we're just filling on. Piece here. some. Yep. Get a little glass block, man. So we're putting glass block was put there in 1885. Are you serious? Yeah. Original glass block. So this, so if we're sitting in here. This is going to be a 42 by 42. Yep. And then you'll piece together the rest. Yep. Because it's 50 by 50. Yep. And then you've got that parent area. People can watch. Yeah, we're going to start hopefully doing some camps first thing we'll do out of the building uh, next summer. You know, I'm trying to, and you know, the camps we're going to do, man, are going to be some pretty big time camps. You know, hopefully we can get uh, some big time, some NCAA champs out of here, like right out of the rip. You know, my man, Nico Magalutis, my new best friend. I like him. He's not bad. No, Nico's. I've been working with him too. Good guy, man. Nico's a good guy. You know, good guy. Financial advisor these days. Shout out to Nico. He's hustling, right? He's hustling, man. So wait, you've got that can of Mac mat. Mm -hmm. You still got the mats over at the old sportatorium? No, it's all stuff full of. Uh, it's we wear. Stock. Yeah, it's we warehouse. warehouse out there. Okay. So yeah, man, we're just looking at you know, my man Dustin Myers. Like I said, is gonna come in and do some awesome strength and conditioning camps and clinics out of here, and uh, we'll do some fun stuff, man. Uh, I love the Friday Night Live philosophy. You know, going to tournaments and sitting there all week, you know, all day and getting two or three matches and blah, blah, blah. I'm really falling in love with the uh, the Friday Night Live philosophy. So I see us doing a lot of Friday Night Lives and, uh, and just wrestling camps. And, you know, we're, we're going to do a lot of novice out here, too. I, I definitely think that right now wrestling is, um, man, it's almost getting a little bit too high level with little guys and... What's well, killing at the community level, I think. It is. And so that's where I, that's what the sport tournament is really going to do is we're going to definitely get back in that community level novice, you know, just basic wrestling, head position. Involvement. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, let's listen. You know, not every kid's going to be a state champ. And we all got to recognize that. I mean, res wrestling makes an unbelievable work ethic. And I, I think that parents talking about what do you get out of wrestling when their kid's 20 years old, he's not a bum. <laughs> If you're a wrestler, you'll never be a bum. You're going to be a hard worker forever, in my opinion. So that's what I like. Would you hire them? Absolutely, man. Wrestlers, How many people work for you? Um, I get about 20 employees. My best my best one is definitely my man, Jeb, man. He makes all my bindings, man. He's, I coached him in high school. He's one of my wrestlers, man. Wrestlers are uh, awesome people, man. They just, they're hard workers. They grind it, man. They're, like, like, like they said in USA Today, if, you, if, if there's a snowstorm and there's 50 people, the only guy going to show up is a wrestler, man. And he ain't going to complain when he gets there. He's going to try to do the work of all 50 people. And uh, like I said, wrestlers are grinders, man. Yeah, I, I mean, I, your work ethic's incredible. It's like, I can't believe it when I look at it. You know, we look at this facility and... And it wasn't fun carrying these mats up those two flights. Yeah, the there's a whole nother section down there too, right? Yeah. You're we gotta, crazy. We gotta get one more. You, you, I, I called labor ready and said, send me 10 guys. Yeah. That's how we got these things. That's up. how you guys horse those up the oh, steps, yeah. huh? I didn't torture my own guys on that one. You know, like I said, man, you ever need a nice, awesome ceiling? I mean, flooring for ceiling. You can have my idea, man. Go I for like it. it. I think that's good. No Don't say that. You need to patent it. Eh, patent it. All right. Eh, you know. All right, let's go check the. Uh, I wanna go back to the gym. I got a couple things I gotta look at, all right? Awesome.